Good evening. Tulsa County Commissioners have declared the county disaster area for our record snowstorm. The snowfall is crippling travel in the area. One positive new development, the Turner Turnpike just reopened. And now the eastbound lanes of I-44 have reopened from Tulsa to the Missouri State Line. Stranded vehicles still on the roadway are keeping the westbound lanes closed, though. Now, it's tough on everyone, especially truck drivers stranded far away from home. That begins this evening's team coverage. They are everywhere on just about all area highways. Big rigs bogged down in our historic snowfall. I'm sitting on a load for two days that I should have had done yesterday. You know. For truck drivers, time is money. Right now, time is dragging on for many of them, like Mark Mahurin. And commerce is snowpacked and stalled. Got here, got stuck. I'll try to dig my way out, but it's a losing cause, man. It's a lost cause for hundreds of drivers. Big rigs are backed up for about a mile on I-44 east of Tulsa. Most turnpikes in the state are impassable and closed. Unfortunately, this is what it's looked like on highways and turnpikes across much of Oklahoma. And for drivers from all over the country with really nowhere to go right now, it's been an ordeal. Well, I'm about out of fuel, and it's four or five degrees or whatever it is, and uh, they're telling me that it could be anywhere from 42 to 78 hours before they get to me. I'm like, man, you got to be kidding me. While some are low on fuel, others are running low on patience. When we talked to Robert Hunt, he had already spent 16 hours stranded. I'm waiting for a record, and I'm on a list, so kind of stuck, but then there ain't no place to go once I do get unstuck. Part of the problem is that there are so many stranded vehicles on Oklahoma turnpikes and other highways, it's hampering efforts to clear snow. ODOT is continuing its call for motorists to stay off the roads. Drifts have topped four feet on some highways. I'm from northern Iowa, and they don't let our roads at home get this bad. This is ridiculous. While crews continue efforts to clear the snow, there is very little drivers can do but wait. Try to keep warm, try to conserve fuel, and hope they can get moving again soon. I got an old boy. He's down in southern Texas, about 75 degrees, so I told him I didn't want to hear it, man. Again, the Turner Turnpike and the eastbound lanes of I-44 from Tulsa to Missouri have now reopened. Tow truck companies.